It's 9.30 in the morning. It's 3.16. What? Can I get a hell yeah? But Austin 3.16. Remember yesterday when we had that story about the Magic the Gathering Lord of the Rings run and in Hasbro and their infinite wisdom decided to release exactly one, one, one copy of the Magic the Gathering one ring card. Well, it turns out that Hasbro claims they were misquoted. Later on the very same day, Hasbro said, no, we never said there was only one, one, one card of this card. No, there's only one foil of this card floating around. We only made one foil, making it the rarest magic card ever, which of course is not true because the rarest magic card ever is Proposal, the card that Richard Garfield gave to his then woman, uh, girlfriend, partner, whatever you want to call it to see if she wanted to marry him. Uh, so that's, I think, believe, the rarest of all magic cards. One foil is in circulation throughout the entire planet of the One Ring Magic the Gathering card. The non-foil card, they claim they made like 150 to 200, which is still pretty abysmally rare, but slightly better chance of you getting this card than the yesterday when they said there was only one. But now Hasbro said, oh, no, 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 you misread. We made 500 of that card, 300 of that card, 200 of that card, and then we've got like 50, 100, and 150. They're not sure, because it's Hasbro, uh, of this card, the one ring card, the uh, tap to get draw one card at one life uh, ridiculous mechanic um, card. So it's not end of the world rare. It's not $15,000 rare. It's not there's only one and people are going to be killing each other over it rare. It's mythical rare. And maybe it might have some value if you find one of the regular ones. Obviously, if you find the foil one, it could be worth a couple hundred thousand. Or it could be worth absolutely nothing because it's magic. So really, you know, take that with a grain of salt. So there you go. Some more news on Hasbro continuing, continuing their running trend of being just geniuses in the world of marketing. Can't understand how they're losing money in the stock market. Can't understand why all the investors are so worried. Can't understand why Japan and China are upset with them. I mean, they continue to make brilliant marketing decisions like this. Turns out Sauron, sorry, buddy. There was like one ring? No, there's like 150 rings, dude. Yeah, you didn't have to go to all that trouble. You just had to go to your Magic the Gathering store and pick up a pack. I mean... The whole thing with Frodo and Mordor and Gollum. What a waste of time. There's 150. 